good. Now we get to Now we can back. Better job. Okay. Gotta keep a clean shave. Today is the 18th of April. And uh, I'm gonna take in a little uh, day of life of an Avon Old Farm soon. It is currently 7.40 a.m. in the morning. And I'm heading to morning meeting. Today we're gonna be in the Brown Auditorium. If I'm lucky enough, I can grab some, uh, some chow before I head over. Um, breakfast is ending in about five minutes, so if I'm quick and grab a quick bite. This is the side entrance to the refectory. Carp man, what's up, dude? What's up? Grabbing some coffee. What is this that? The video, dude. I'm, yeah, I'm vlogging the whole day. You're vlogging. I'm filming myself like this the whole day. Yeah, I'm recording it. I want to show people what it's like to be a David Olmar suit. How's it going? Um, I'm the Avon suit. Yeah. Some for coffee. Not yeah. the best coffee in the world, that's for sure. But it will do the trick. It will do the trick. That's, that's what really matters. Yeah, it's always nice to hear uh, some footloose in the morning. Get get your, get your vibes going a little bit. Can you see me now? What's up? Tell me when you finish the video. Oh, yeah, I mean, I've been working on it all day. See, when that happens, that's unfortunate. Oh. Alright, almost done with this, so I'm gonna go throw it into the kitchen. Castle. Castle. Come, come join the vlog. So, this is what it's gonna be like to be, you know, what is it like to be a student at Animal Farms, right? So, I'm gonna walk around filming myself all day. So I can show everyone how great it is. It's a great experience. It's the Avon experience. Right? Absolutely. Right. Except, except I'm not a student. We got guys like this. You know, we got guys like this. John Park, this is my roommate, just in case. He's from Korea. Korea. He's a great guy. He's an amazing cellist, and he's really smart. He's going to Carnegie Mellon. So I'm really proud of him. So right now we're walking to morning meeting, <laughs> like I mentioned earlier in the video. And uh, we all converge at this spot over here. Brown Auditorium. I'm not sure if that's focused or not. There's no hiding. This is this is what it's really like. Okay, what is morning work. meeting about? What what do we do here every morning? Morning meeting is about the community, uh, most of all. I mean, that's the way I always identify it. Morning meeting is really about bringing the community together, sharing what's happening on this particular day, and then talking about things that are relevant for the entire week or for whatever's happening with the individual classes. So Mr. LaRock talked about spring. He talked about sports. We had this opportunity to hear from Skylar Go, which was a culmination of his art project. And so I think that when those things happen in isolation, we are not the type of school that we could be as, uh, if we bring it all together. And so morning meeting is about bringing everybody together so that everyone is sufficiently informed and understand what's going on. <laughs> so what is it, what exactly is your position again? Okay. Dean of Faculty. Now the morning meeting is over, I have some time in between now and then before class starts to grab a package and get my stuff for class, like a notepad, pen, whatnot. Rodrigo, what's up? He's from Venezuela. Uh, there it is, the Watcher Post Office. This is where everyone keeps their mail. Hello, 631. What's up, Talk? How you doing? Good. I'm really not sure what this is. So, first class of the day is World War II. So I'm gonna need my notepad, pen, and we're all set. Morning, guys. Hey, what's up? 
All right, so we're walking to class. Uh, this classroom is in Pelican. I'll show you the quad once we get in there. But we're walking towards it right now. Yo, what's up, Nate? What's up, sweet? Elephant, Eagle Dormitory, Pelican Dormitory. We are now in World War II class. Should we go? Good morning. Good morning. Uh, we are taking attendance right now, I assume. Yeah. yeah. Cool. What's Doing a little day-to-day -day, uh, what it's like to be an Avon Old Farm student. Excellent. So, yeah. 1970. Oh my God. You know, Patton was 1970. He's coming up the road in a few minutes. What's up, dude? Really? SAT. SAT prep. Well, have fun, man. Nice. So one of the best parts about Avon is, you know, being able to walk past this beautiful vista every morning. That would be the bell. There's Kelvin, one of the most talented singers here at Avon. Exactly. But uh, yeah, this is basically where we converge every day or not every day when we have class and sing. So it turns out we don't have class today. Mrs. Zaros is sick, so we're just gonna have to take this as a free period. So we're gonna go head up to the Hawks Nest, grab a milkshake, maybe a uh, bacon, egg, and cheese sandwich. And uh, yeah, generally during free periods, people will come to the Hawks Nest to grab a snack or watch TV, or go downstairs, there's ping pong tables. If you're a good student, study. So we got Matt Gill over here. How are you? One of the best baseball players out there. Yeah. And Zach Worthen. Hello. He's a character. Yeah, good I'm golfer. A, I'm a great good golfer. Good golfer. Good morning, how are you? Nice back. to see you. If you want to get a sandwich, other slip is for a milkshake. Shake. These things are addictive. Uh, we are right now I'm with John, my roommate, he's over here. We are uh, in our free period still. Um, we're going to go ahead and study, right? You know, when you have free time, you know, it's always a good idea to uh, you know, catch up on whatever you can. Uh, I'm going to study for an environmental test I have this Wednesday, so let's get to it. John, where are you heading? Club period, environmental. Club, you're the head of the environmental, right? Yeah. Alright man, have fun. Let's see what's in this box. Uh, let's see. Football cleats. Throw the javelin, so it's good to have these uh, when you release the jav. Throw, you put your foot forward, you can't cross the line, gets a good grip on the, on the uh, field, so. One thing you should know about Avon is if you come here as a student, you are going to embark on the biggest, biggest schedule ever. It's, it's actually brilliant keeps you busy, teaches you how to be prioritized. You're on a constant 24-7 schedule, and you learn to love it. I'm walking around during my free period, you know, enjoying the beautiful uh, environment that Avon has to offer, and I run into Mr. Kowalczyk. So what's the assignment you have for me, Mr. Kowalczyk? What's a, what's a vlog? A vlog is essentially a video and a blog combined into one word. What that means is that I'm gonna be walking around videotaping myself okay. the entire day. So it's sort of like a day in the life of an Avon Old Farm student. That's cool, that's pretty tech savvy. Yeah, it is. Got a couple hats. Uh, okay. One of our yeah, alums. Uh -huh. uh, it's his business. It's this incredible business. It's it's very fitting for a sunny day today because it's uh, sun protective mm -hmm. clothing. Right. Uh, so long sleeve shirts with the uh, with the sun protection protection built into I like it. it. And so what we're gonna do is I'm gonna give you some of the hats. Right, throw cool. those on some of the Avon boys. Let's and do take it. A couple pictures. Let's I think do we got our, right now. we got some victims right here. Right Ooh, yeah. Man. What's up, guys? It's a minute. So just stay put. All right. Let's go get these hats. Where are they? <laughs> These are one of the beautiful offices that uh, Avon has for uh, the admissions department. Let's check these out. What do we got here? What are we working with? Horse here. Oh, Sweet. Right. Got three models. Yeah, we have a very, very good looking student body. Model A, Model B, Model C. Not the three most devilishly attractive <laughs> but they'll do it. Yeah. All right, man. So let's see what we're working with. Nice. Oh, yeah, Mott 50. I like it. These are nh nice. Of course you can keep them, man. I got whole boxes. We give them to the whole lacrosse team. 
Oh, yes. So, so it's Mott 50. What exactly is that again? So it's a skin protective uh, sun protection uh, clothing company. It's started by uh, the wife of one of our alums. And Show you. Show you. Duh. Please, what do you want? What's up, man? Blue and orange. Uh, everyone's got the blue. Go for the orange. Dude, loving it. You look sick. No, you didn't. That guy knows how to market. Got these four hats. I'm going to give them away. One of which I'm going to keep, so I'm going to give away three. Um, yeah, pretty much anyone I see. Yo, I got a present for you, dude. Oh, thanks. Check it out. Check it out. Mott 50 snapbacks. All right. Take one. Making people happy. Two free snapbacks. Who wants one? Free snapbacks. You want one? All right. Got Chase one. Got this guy one. Awesome. So, during the free period, uh, we have on guys, this particularly day students. We just like to come down here and hang out uh, during a free period. But uh, yeah, we just hang out down here. Good stuff. Sir and Emery Calcinari. Oh, How's no. It? How's it hanging, man? So, negative 290. Yeah. Like, that's so good. So, we're still working on distributing these hats. Are you still vlogging? Yeah, we just we just got one to Mr. Martinez. He's a fan of Mod Ma 50 now. Yes. Yeah, especially with the bald head, but you kind of look like a train conductor a little yeah, bit. Yeah, you like, do. Whatever it is, but it's you awesome. look good, man. I like it. Get style right now. Oh, thanks. All right, now we got um, a period called advisor lunch, uh, essentially where you go and meet with your advisor and sit down with them at the lunch table and enjoy some chow. Catch up on anything you want, whether it be what you're gonna do today, how you did on your last test. Um, but yeah, always a great selection with the Flick Dining Service. It's really that. We got we have barbecue chicken, barbecue chicken, sweet potatoes, sweet potatoes, sweet potatoes and veggie burgers. Steamed vegetables, veggie burgers. I like it, man. Just an example of how amazing the student to faculty relationships are on campus. Look how beautiful it is. Just walking together, smiling, catching up about sure. their days. Five minutes of fame. It does not get better than that. It doesn't get better than that. Okay, now we got Spanish class. Spanish 4 with Miss Melison. How are you doing today? I'm not doing How are you? Como estas? Bien? Bien? What's up, guys? Yeah. Great class? Mm -hmm. Awesome. Uh, so we've been watching a movie. Uh, what was what was the name? La Bamba. La Bamba about Richie Valens, the famous uh, Hispanic musician who died at I think he died at like 17, right? Pretty sad, but it's about his uprising and how he became famous. So it's fun, and we're learning a lot. We're able to listen to the Spanish and sort of uh, taking as much as we can in that sense. Yeah, I know seniors aren't going to be here tomorrow. Can you guys get up? Go through here, your choices. Handle roll, gender roll. Okay, the class we're heading to now is uh, English 4 with Mr. French. He's a young guy. You'll really like him. What is the vlog thing about having class outside? It's your French, what's up? Not a lot. <laughs> Say hi to the camera. Hello. Yeah. James. Plus, Zach so, gets a great Rick or footage. Rick Oroya. This, this is senior yeah. English class. Now, what do you think? Should we uh, go outside and read today? What do you think? It's a beautiful day. We're just so hot outside. I mean, Tom and I both agree. That yeah, we I agree. That's not hot it's like perfect. I read books on my please laptop. Don't, don't I never really back. buy the paperback. I just generally go on iBooks, purchase a book, read it off that. Everyone else has paperback, but that's fine. I'm talking to the camera. All right, we have convinced the teacher. <laughs> what? What's up? my day.
uh, yeah. last class of the day. Here we go. Here we go. G period. Uh, this is Probs and Stats with Mr. Brennan. Okay, now that the day's over, now we uh, have afternoon activities. Baseball? Uh, yeah. Yeah? What are you doing? What team you on? Uh, JV. JV baseball? Yeah, How's JV. How's that going? How's the record so far? Oh, uh, good. I think we're like two and one. Two and one. There so. you go. Positive student body. Yeah, I'm going to go get ready for track and start heading down to the fields. That was a long day of classes, oh my god. Okay, now I'm gonna head down to the track field and gonna get some jab in. I also do a little sprinting. Generally practices uh, last around an hour, an hour and a half for uh, track and field, so let's head down there and have some fun. So we got Ryan Lanchbear over here, one of the star lacrosse athletes on the varsity team. Were you guys being tapered yesterday? Oh, uh, Saturday, yeah. Saturday. All right, we're on our way down the hill. Sometimes it get a little uh, tough if you don't have the right shoes, all the rocks slide. <laughs> all right, so we're almost down the track field with my boy Jack, Jack Gaffney. Hi, Sweetler. Yeah, um, so uh, just a quick little uh, brief on track and field. Two of us are mainly throwers, right? Yep. Throw the javelin, I throw the javelin, uh, and then we have other guys who throw the discus, which is essentially like a disc, weight, a weighted disc, um, and there's like all this technique that it goes into throwing it, as with javelin, there's technique, and the other one is pot shot. All right, so we've made it to the pole vault pit. It's essentially where we all meet every day before practice starts. So we out here, Mr. French just got, just got to the field. Oh, no. <laughs> He's ready for the day. Back at it again. You ready again. for coach day? I'm uh -huh. ready. Yeah, it's gonna be fun. You saw him in English class, but he's also a coach. This is what makes him awesome. <laughs> 19, three and a half, and then it went down from there. Uh, triple jump. All right, just finished practice. I'm out of breath because, you know, you have to walk up that hill coming from the fields. The one I came down on gets your calves going real good. Next up, I think I'm gonna go hit the weight room. Okay. That was a day at Avon. Every day you come out of here, you feel accomplished for what you've done. Every day is a new day filled with all sorts of roadblocks. And the best part of Avon is it teaches you how to get around those roadblocks. So, all right guys, peace. Hold it out. Yeah, I gotta hold it up. Hey, yo, it's Juice here. You feel me? It's my boy Nick. Yo, Nick, say what's up, y'all. What's good? What's good, y'all? Hey, yo, Liam, say what up, y'all. Say what up, Liam. It's my teacher right here. I'm about to show you real quick. Cool. Hey, yo, man, what's your name, man? What's up? Zach. Yo, say what up to the camera, man. What's up? All right, man. Hey, yo, my boy. Yo, say what up to the camera. Off. Off. This bread is not like.